This isn't just a monorail. It's a colossal, game-changing project with a staggering budget that will revolutionize urban transportation in Egypt's bustling capital. A sleek, high-speed transit system glides above the city, parting the sea of traffic below. The figures behind this project are mind-boggling. We're talking kilometers of cutting-edge tracks, state-of-the-art stations, and a fleet of futuristic trains powered by the latest technology. A symbol of progress, a beacon of innovation, and a bold statement of Egypt's commitment to a more connected, efficient, and sustainable future. Today, we're talking about Cairo Monorail. Project Overview In August 2019, Bombardier Transportation partnered with Oriscom Construction and the Arab Contractors to sign a whopping $4.5 billion deal. They're building not one, but two ultra-modern monorail lines in Egypt. Yeah, you heard that right, $4.5 billion. Now, let's talk about what this means. Monorail is a high-speed rail marvel, soaring above traditional trains and metros in speed and innovation. It glides on a solitary rail suspended above or tucked beneath its sleek carriages. These monorails are like something out of a sci-fi movie. We're looking at 74-car Enovia Monorail 300 trains. That's 280 cars decked out with the latest tech. It's set to be the longest monorail system in the world at an incredible 98.5 kilometers. The first line is a 54-kilometer stretch from East Cairo all the way to the new administrative capital, featuring 22 stations. The second line connects Giza to the 6th of October city over 42 kilometers with 12 stations. Think about the convenience. You could get to the new capital in about 60 minutes and to the 6th of October city in around 42 minutes, cruising at 80 kilometers an hour. And at peak times, these monorails can carry around 45,000 passengers every hour. This is more than a project, it's a lasting impact. 34 state-of-the-art stations, maintenance facilities, depots, and an operations control center, Cairo Monorail will redefine urban transportation in Egypt. Key features. Let's talk economy. This monorail is a critical piece in Egypt's massive transport network upgrade. We're looking at boosted industrial developments and big-time investments. It's all about strengthening Egypt's economy and making travel smoother and faster. Now, onto the network itself. The Cairo monorail is designed to weave an extensive city web, linking residential areas with commercial hotspots. Imagine stepping out of your home and hopping on a monorail to get to work, shopping, or anywhere else in the city. Super convenient, right? No, it's better. The monorail will intersect with Cairo Metro's Line 3 and the high-speed rail network. It is not a standalone system, but a part of a bigger, more dynamic Cairo region. Hill International CEO Rauf Ghali said this project shows how strong the market in North Africa, especially Egypt, is right now. What's really cool is how this all ties together. With the monorail in the mix, citizens are going to have a bunch of easy transfer options. It's all about creating a more connected, efficient urban transport network. And here's a neat feature. The Cairo monorail is mostly elevated. That means it navigates above the city streets, cutting down on the need for ground level infrastructure. Less land use, faster construction. It's a win-win. Investment. This project is a big deal financially and a clear sign of the government's dedication to ramping up the transportation infrastructure. Here's where it gets interesting. This monorail is seen as a perfect chance to show off the success of public-private partnerships in the country. The way this project is being executed is pretty unique, too. It's done on an EPC plus finance basis. What does that mean? Basically, the company behind the project is not just building it. They're also arranging a big chunk of the foreign funding needed. The financing is backed by export credit agencies. It comes from a group of international banks led by JP Morgan, with support from UKEF. The Egyptian Parliament's Transport and Communications Committee has arranged a massive $2.2 billion loan agreement for the Cairo monorail project in the new administrative capital and the 6th of October city. Benefits and impact. It's all about connection. We're talking about multiple monorail lines linking the heart of Cairo to its bustling suburbs. These lines are carefully designed to serve densely populated areas, major transport hubs, and key business districts. 
Imagine hopping on the monorail and zooming to your destination, skipping all that crazy traffic. The Egyptian government is betting big on this project to tackle Cairo's escalating traffic woes. Considering the city's growing population and economic activity, it's a smart move. Raouf Ghali says this project is all about demographic factors, smart planning, and innovation driving growth in Egypt. And he's expecting Egypt to set a global standard in ambitious infrastructure projects like this one. This project is also about the environment. The monorail runs on electricity, making it a cost-effective and eco-friendly option compared to other public transport. Fewer emissions, less pollution. That's what we're talking about. And the safety features are top-notch. With a fully automated, driverless system, the risk of road accidents and human errors drops significantly. Who is behind the project? Firstly, it's Oraskom Construction, an Egyptian powerhouse that leads the charge. They're bringing in experts from all over to design and build this incredible infrastructure. We're talking about stations, guideway structures, and depot buildings. Bombardier Transportation is a big name in the transport world. They're handling everything from power supply to the rolling stock, signaling, and communication systems. Plus, they've got automatic train control, an operations control center, platform screen doors, fare collection, you name it. They're also managing the overall project, making sure everything runs smoothly from start to finish. Now, let's talk trains. The project uses 70 Bombardier Enovia 300 fully automated driverless monorail trains. These beauties are made from extruded aluminum, corrosion resistant and recyclable. And with rubber tires for a quieter, smoother ride, they can zip through sharp turns and steep slopes like a breeze. Chosen for their top performance in crowded cities and driverless operations, these trains are a perfect fit for Cairo. They've got advanced communication tech and smart power management, making them super energy efficient. But there's another key player here, the Schindler Group. This Swiss multinational supplies, installs, and maintains 136 elevators and 272 escalators. The monorail also features Bombardier's CityFlow 650 signaling and automatic train control technology. This means driverless operations using cutting-edge moving block technology. Plus, there's a state-of-the-art operation control center communication system and all the other electrical and mechanical equipment you can think of. And get this. The partnership between Orascom and Arab contractors is long-lasting. They've been teaming up for over 25 years, delivering big projects like underground railways and Suez Canal tunnels. Now, they're bringing their A-game to the monorail project. Luxury transport for tourists. It's not just for locals to zip around the city. The Egyptian monorail is also being designed as a top-tier convenient transport option for tourists. Think about it. You're in Cairo, and you want to check out iconic sites like the Citadel, the National Museum of Egyptian Civilization, or the Egyptian Museum in Tahrir Square. The monorail is your ticket to a smooth, luxurious journey to these attractions right above the hassle of traffic. And there's more. The monorail will offer direct connections to some of the hottest tourist spots. We're talking about a line to the Haram area of Giza, with stations opposite the Grand Egyptian Museum and the Giza Pyramid Complex. Can you imagine a more epic way to travel to see the pyramids? A booster dose for the economy. This monorail project is about moving people and giving them jobs. From the construction phase to the ongoing operation and maintenance, this project is stimulating economic activity in a big way. It's like a domino effect on Cairo's economy. It's set to kickstart economic activity through a smart public-private partnership. This means better labor productivity, top-notch risk assessment, and a lot of expertise, especially from the private sector, which handles innovation and tech advancements. The monorail is also expected to boost Egypt's industrial sector big time. Egypt's planning to set up its first factory to produce all kinds of trains. We're talking monorail, railway, and metro. This means more jobs, a jump in national income, and a stronger industrial base. If the Cairo monorail nails this, it could set a whole new standard for future urban transport projects in Egypt. We're talking about a blueprint for tackling the big challenges of rapid urbanization and population growth. The Cairo monorail isn't just a transport project, it's a leap into the future of urban mobility. Think about it, a city that grows smarter, travels faster, and lives better. That's the promise of the Cairo monorail. 
But what are your thoughts on the biggest Egyptian mega project and the biggest monorail in the world? Let us know in the comment section. Make sure to like and subscribe so you never miss the exciting content we send your way.